Press the bell icon and never miss an update from Bollywood Now. Singing sensation Sonu Nigam shaved off his head during a media interaction to prove his point on his series of controversial tweets on Azan and loudspeakers. It was being said that a fatwa was issued when Al Qadri, the vice president of West Bengal Minority United Council, announced a reward of rupees 10 lakhs to a person who will shave Sonu Nigam's head. But in a major twist in the tale, cleric Sayyid Shah Atif Ali Al Qadri has denied in a report that there was no fatwa issued against Sonu Nigam. He reportedly said, I wish to state that there was no fatwa issued against Nigam. I reacted to his tweet on Azan. I would like to say that if you need to live in a democratic, secular country like India, you have to live with every religion. He further said, Today Sonu has shaved off his head, but he still needs to perform two other deeds to get the reward of Rs 10 lakh. I had mentioned a garland of old shoes and that he would have to roam around the entire nation. Once he fulfills the two deeds, I will hold a press conference and hand over the cheque to Nigam. In yet another report, Nuru Rehman Barkati, the Imam of Tipu Sultan Mosque of Kolkata, who is also known as the Fatwa Imam, reportedly said, I had a word with Kadri, and he clarified to me that it was his opinion to counter that of Sonu Nigam. If the singer can have his freedom of expression, so has anybody else. If Nigam is disturbed by the sound of namaz and that of temple and church bells, he should shift his house to a spot where none of these reach him. Well, Sonu's tweet has certainly irked many. It will be interesting to watch what drama unfolds in this controversy.